Uh, let's see how it's affecting both ends of the country this morning. First of all, we'll talk to Davy Donaldson, who's in Glasgow for us. Morning, Davy. Yeah, good morning, Stephen. Yeah, I have to say a lot of people are waiting to see what happens, but I think most people know what's going to happen, sadly. I think we all know what's coming. Uh, it's like the Grim Reaper, I feel, standing here giving you this news. But, uh, yeah, certainly it's going to go up by around about £1,500. So that's going to have a huge impact on people's bills, clearly, up to around the £3,500 mark. So uh, you can imagine how that's going to affect people. Uh, a lot of people, obviously, clearly and happy about it. You talked about people striking, people striking because they need that extra money in the pay packet simply to pay the bills. Of course, this is not going to come into effect until, uh, you know, um, the 1st of October. Yesterday, I spoke to some people in Edinburgh to get their thoughts on the latest energy crisis. It's going to get worse and a lot of people are going to be pushed into poverty and the government needs to do more about it. The Westminster government needs to sort it out. Finally, we're hearing the opposition, Labour, saying something positive to address it. I think they should be doing, you know, following their, the government should be following their lead. They're, they're finally stepping up and showing some leadership. A lot of people are going to be extremely poor who are already poor, um, but it's complicated because the oil companies make a lot of profit. There's the bill billing part as well. It's complicated, but no, it's wrong. I mean, my energy's gone up. I think they want about six hundred pound a month at the moment, from two hundred. So yeah, it's a big jump. They're still getting two hundred a month though. Yeah, obviously we heard there people clearly very unhappy about what's happening, but there is some solutions. There are some solutions being offered. Uh, the chief executive here of Scottish Power, he said he's going to uh, freeze prices for two years, and that will generate £100 billion in terms of uh, revenue that people would normally have to pay. We've also heard from British Gas who are going to donate 10% of their profits to help customers cope with soaring bills for the duration of the energy crisis. So there is some light at the end of the tunnel. However, I think the news that we're going to hear around about 40 minutes' time is not going to be good. No, indeed. Davy, thank you. Say thank you. Don't mean thank you at all, really, Davy. It's, it's, <laughs> it's, it's not it's it's utterly not, depressing.